Hey guys, uh, I mentioned in a video that I had a Mustang and a lot of people wanted to see it, so here it is. It is my baby. It's a 2007 Ford Mustang GT. Sorry for the background. Uh, my neighbor is mowing their lawns, but um, let's make sure this is unlocked. Okay. Alright, so this is my 2007 Ford Mustang GT. I'm um, sorry if there's a bit of shakiness because I, I will be, you know, moving around. I don't know what the lights just turned on. Or I unlocked it, but I don't know what it's on. So, it is a convertible. Kind of funny look from that guy, but, um, I decided to make this video and play it in there. Um, I might annotate it out of there. So, here it is. And I'll talk a little bit more about it in a second when I get the full view. Alright. Set up right here. Alright, as you can see, this is not a standard front end for a Mustang. This is, I bought this used, so all the modifications are what I had when I got it, and I'll tell you about that. So, first off, um, he changed the grill right here. Normally the two headlights are farther apart, and then there's a Mustang in there. It's a custom grill, and it's down lower too. Um, hold on, let me pull this off of my tripod. Again, sorry for shakiness. It's about four inches off the ground, which looks freaking awesome, but the only problem is, right there as long as most of the bottom it's really really hard see right there too since it's so low going up curves is a pain in the ass seriously sorry put it back on all right so we got the racing stripes right here which are totally cool make this thing look so badass um Hopefully, because they're they are just stickers, so I'm not gonna be able to show you. But okay. do you see that black stuff? That's just from being kind of old, I guess. I don't know why it's like that, but since it is a sticker, you can kind of see how it's raised right there. Um, I do want to get it painted on, so that's I think that was what I'm gonna work for next summer. Um. So yeah, gotta gotta get that. But everything else on it is great. Me. Actually, I'm gonna leave you right here. Sorry, I look really bad right now. Kind of grungy because I just washed the car. I'm actually gonna put the top down. So. about the delay. Alright, so here it is. This is top down. Alright. So here's what it looks like on the inside. It's got the awesome red leather seats that look really great right now because I just um, conditioned them. The top down. Give you an overview and then I'll get in it. Can seat four. Like the they have that bump right there, so alright. The door right here. Very cool like grooves in here. Speaker, speaker. Alright. It's gonna be kinda difficult, but let's see what we got here. Um the Shaker 500 sound system, which is the boosted up, it is thick. 
I actually never driven an automatic before. Um, passenger side. This is really cool. It reminds me of carbon fiber. Um, all along the dash. Air vents. Um, let's see. So I'm kind of winging it. So if anything looks at hazard, that's because it kind of is. Alright. Alright. Alright, I want to show you something kind of cool. Um, Alright, see like my speedometer right there and that right there. See it turns red when I turn on my headlight. Sorry, I'll turn that down. Okay. When it goes on, it turns red, and you can actually change it to every color of the rainbow. So, that's really cool. I chose red because of the interior, but you can change it to blue, orange, green, depending on, um, you know, the color car you have. You got the Mustang right there. It's kind of crooked, but yeah. That's it. It's actually funny because I don't, I do not have my license, and before anybody says I'm spoiled, um... I, this wasn't like a gift for my 16th birthday. I paid for half of this. And I've been saving up for this ever since I was, like, two. So, why did I get it before turn on it? The, um, it was a great deal. This is my dr absolute dream car. I've always loved Mustang. And, the GT right there. Um, and, just do this. It's a really nice day out today. The trees look really cool up there. We have these huge hundred year old oak trees right here. They're really awesome but suck because we do occasionally have ice storms and the ice will um it'll ice your limbs and they'll fall right off and cut off your power for days. Which sucks. Um, all right, let me give you another, another little panorama, if you will. Top down. No, I think I just did that. Here's it from the back. It's freaking awesome, awesome car. Um, yeah, but I, I'm doing my first day in car tomorrow. I will be getting my license probably next month, which is very exciting. By the end of the next month, it, whoa, sorry, <laughs> my tripod freaks out sometimes. Um, yep, but should be getting my license soon after my in cars, because I have them like for two weeks. I don't know why my lights. Oh, I forgot to turn my lights off. Stand by. That'll do it. Okay. All right, guys. I'll leave you with this beautiful image. By the way, her name is Baby. I tried a couple other names, but I kept just kept calling her my baby and just saying baby, baby, baby. So, Baby is her name. She's beautiful, and I love her. So, thank you for watching this video. Uh, post any questions. Actually, one more thing. I feel like I might get asked. Stand by again. Got a muscle car? Might as well show off the muscle, huh? Tell you how many horsepower it was. Honestly, I don't, I'm not quite sure. Um, 
But it's a lot. More than I probably need. I'm not racing or anything. She's a beaut, that's for sure. That looks cool. Alrighty. Well, guys, there's my car. Um, thank you for watching. Post any questions. And, you know what? Have a great day.